Today is the day when the people of Berlin have raised their voices. The people of Berlin today are calling to the world. You people of the world, you people in America, in England, in France, in Italy, look at this city and see that you may not abandon this city, that you cannot abandon this city. There is only one possibility for us, to stand together united until this battle is won, until this fight is finally sealed with victory over our enemies, with victory over the powers of darkness. The people of Berlin have spoken. We have done our duty, and we will keep on doing our duty. People of the world, now do your duty. After the meeting ended, a clash at the Brandenburger Tor, as Russian police fired into the crowds returning home. The casualties, one 15-year-old boy dead, 12 wounded. Then another incident. The red flag of communism is torn down from atop the Brandenburger Tor. Meanwhile, in the American sector, leaders of the three democratic parties and thousands of supporters from the Reichstag rally make their way up Potsdamer Strasse toward the ACA building. They bring a memorandum for the military governors, a detailed record of Soviet and SED oppression in Berlin. This memorandum, climaxing the day's mass meeting, expresses to all the world the Berlin people's will to freedom. <laughs> 